Okay, so, um, here I am, I'm back again. Alright, let me just see my borders real quick, right there. There, of course, there, and here. Okay, so, I'm actually really happy right now, guys. Um, let me turn the volume down on this, uh, game real quick so that, just in case I didn't do it, um, low enough. Just in case I didn't put it low enough, um... How do I go back? Dirt. Oh. Just in case I didn't put it low enough uh, on the, what is it, X split settings, um, turn the volume down right there and the music so that you guys can hear me. And then I guess I'll also turn the game volume down a little more. There we go. Okay, so as you guys can see, look at this. Look at me. Woo! 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 I'm going everywhere. Look at me. My fingers in between my fingers. All that stuff. Oh, crap. In case you noticed anything on that. I don't know. Never mind. Okay. Um, I'm going to come straight out with this. This behind me. The, cr uh, the whole entire background removal that I got going on right now. This is not real. This is not Intel real sense. This is not the technology of the Razer Stargazer. I just want to get that out there. What I have set up right now is a green screen behind me, very cheap green screen, and uh, two lights, very cheap lights, just two, with uh, umbrellas on them to soften the light. Um, and of course I'm using XSplit Gamecaster right now, and just from looking at the preview, uh, it, the results are flawless. They're amazing, you know? Look at that. Where's my fingers? Where are my fingers? There they are. Just, of course, because it, it's not, you know, dynamic background removal. Of course, everything looks perfect. Um, I didn't have to mess with the tolerance or anything of, you know, in the settings for uh, this, what do you call it? Um, X split. I just, bam shows chroma key you know it's already set to green of course and it just bam everything is perfect so let's uh let's just play a real quick game and see what happens you know let's see how this goes oh man by the way for anyone who's wondering it took me literally about five to six minutes maybe seven maybe maybe even less than five to set up the two lights and the green screen behind me it's so simple it's easy and with a program like XSplit so simple to operate and you know set up the uh, chroma key and just knock your background right out so that you have your the whole gameplay behind you is just amazing. It's it's great. Seeing it looks like the top of my hair and my chair, or whatever, is a little blurry, but whatever. Actually, I, I don't know. Whatever. It's just it's 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 miles better than what I've experienced with Real Sense so far. And um, I I just gotta say that this this is great so far. So. With that said, let's just uh, let's play a quick, 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 quick game of uh, what you call it? Uh, what is this game? Insurgency. Let's play a quick game, just you know, to get a feel for it. If you're wondering what's behind me right there, this is just my chair. This isn't like anything fucking around with the any bullshit, you know, left in the background or whatever. My background is completely gone. Okay completely gone. It's just me and my chair. Everything behind my chair is, you know, the green screen. The green screen is, you know, it's obviously right behind me, so. Yeah, um, let's just play real quick. Play a quick game. Get this uploaded so you all can see how much prettier, how much more quality there is to, uh, The, the, the physical green screen setup with two lights on either side to, to try and keep that uh, spread minimum, or not minimum, to keep that spread even 
so that there's a uh, so that you don't have to mess with uh, the whole entire tolerance to, to, to include shadows and different tints. Okay? Yeah, let's take this guy over, whatever. Come on, oh. Oh, excuse me. Why did I take that pistol out? Oh, come on, man, get back here. There you go. Okay, let's see who's over here. No one. Oh. What have we got going on? Oh, look at all these dead dudes. Look at those dead tires. Alpha. What do you think you're doing, bud? Oh, no. Alright, we'll take you over. Oh my gosh, why did I get this guy again? The fucking dude with a shotgun and like, what is this, an ACOG scope? Some type of scope, dude. Like, what is with this? Because I need to really scope in with my shotgun. What is this, the division? This is the division. There are no shotgun snipers in this game. For all of you who don't get that, division. Oh my gosh. Try and play any raid, or what are they called, incursion? The enemies with shotguns are just fucking OP. So OP. It's like retar- It's retar- Damn knife. It's retarded, I'm telling you. Give me your gun. Oh, it's the fucking sh Why? 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 Oh my gosh, no reload. That's right, when you pick up a gun, you can't fucking reload it. For whatever reason. Oh, you're bad? Oh crap, I thought you were on my team, dude. Oh, and you're not on my team either. Ugh. Awesome. Fucking awesome. Oh, I don't have a knight or a fucking. I don't have a sidearm with this. Uh, find a weapon real quick. Thank you. Uh oh. Die. Fall down. Nice. Okay, who else is yonder? Who else is over yonder? Let's see if someone's trying to sneak around the cut. No. Oh, oh! Bastard, hello. What do you slump over? Hey, where the hell are you going? Get back here. Tell me what to do, boy. Boy. Alright, let's find these, uh... Find these towel rag, towel rags. Towel heads, whatever. And there we have it. Quick victory, whatever, blah, blah, blah. But most importantly, folks, I am very elated over my recent discovery of XSplit. Honestly, I gotta say XSplit is a great program and um go to the main menu xsplit's a great program because of the integrated uh, everything like uh, you can change the tolerance for the shadows and tints on your green screen to make it sure it includes all of your green screen there's no splotching or whatever anywhere um uh, uh the inclusion the actual inclusion of uh the ability to use intel real sense for those of you who don't want to get a green screen who might think it's too complicated we don't have the money even though like there's no excuse for there's no excuse to uh, say oh I don't have the money for a green screen and lights green screen lights and Logitech C920 163 dollars Razer Stargazer 150 dollars no excuse none none at all and if you already have a webcam the uh, what do you call it the thingy the lights and um, green screen 50 plus about 30, maybe 40. So 80 or 90 dollars for lights and a green screen. No excuse, okay? It just, it, from the looks of it right now, it, it's it's flawless, okay? So, um, yeah. Thanks for watching, and uh, I hope this answers some, some thoughts or questions for any of you out there. See ya.